Welcome to a very special old school episode of Monday Night Raw. And we're starting things off with a money in the bank ladder match qualifying match. Featuring first the former WWE Champion Umaga. This man's been on a roll but he got the title taken away from him by Roman Reigns. He tried to get it back in the chamber match but it fell short. Next opportunity to get the title back, win this match, go to Mania to win that briefcase and hanging above their head. As Umaga waiting for his opponent to come out, we got two more matches set for tonight. After this, it'll be a number one contenders tag team match. The winners will face the tag team champions, The Bar at WrestleMania. And of course, in our main event, it will be Stone Cold Steve Austin versus MVP. Those two men got a lot of history. And Austin wants revenge because of what happened at SummerSlam of this year. We're getting that in the main event, but right here, main focus. Umaga will be taking on the former World Heavyweight Champion a couple years ago, the animal Batista. Batista lost to Triple H for the Intercontinental Championship. Loser leaves SmackDown match a couple of months ago. Batista got signed to the Raw brand. And here he is on the old school episode of Monday Night Raw facing Umaga for a chance to go to WrestleMania to be part of the Money in the Bank ladder match. And of course, next episode of Universe Man will be another old school episode. It'll be on SmackDown. Can't wait for that. We'll crown a new Intercontinental Champion because the title has been vacated. Because Randy Orton had to punch somebody else in the skull after The Rock, I guess the former SmackDown GM, got punched in the skull again. The Rock is out of uh, commission. But we've seen a new SmackDown GM start the show off. And. You never guess who it is. I guess we'll find out next episode. Referee in position and a kick out by Umaga. Batista, Umaga, qualifying match from the Money in the Bank ladder match at WrestleMania. This match is incredible from start to finish. But of course, right here, Umaga, former WWE champion of this year, another super kick to Batista and a headbutt. I'm hoping it was the stomach. That's all I'm gonna say. And now, Batista in the corner, just like that. Oh, God, what a splash. What a splash. And Batista's gonna hurt, feel that in the morning. As Umaga, Uso splash. On top of the animal, Batista into the cover. And a kick out by Batista. And Batista, a knee right to the head. And Umaga, big right hand to the side of the head. And Umaga now, no boots on. Classic Samoan tribe thing. I um, think, I'm not sure, but Batista, spine buster, takes down Umaga. The Samoan bulldozer kicks out. Batista got to do a lot more damage to put away Umaga. It took multiple spears, guillotines, Superman punches to put away Umaga. And of course, it took a whole lot of F5s from the Beast to put down Umaga Survivor Series. I might need another, just one Samoan spike to Batista put the animal down for good. Put it back in the cage. No, he's not. Umaga can't believe it. Batista kicks out. Could do a lot more damage to the animal to put him away. Oh, what a super kick. That might do it. Just like that. And a kick out. Batista didn't get enough kick out of that. He's only the shoulder up. That's all he needs. As Umaga puts Batista right back down to the mat. Into a Samoan drop. Into the cover. Two. And not a three. Batista kicks out again. And a knee to Batista. Now Batista got fear else to do in this matchup as he tries to do something here. 
Sidewalk slam. Push down. Umaga with a face on his face. Hold on, I didn't say that. Look in the face on Umaga. There it is. What is going on with me today? I just talked right over him. Batista, close on again. Look for a third one. Boom, down goes Umaga. Gary Batista that we know and love. The fans on their feet. They want Batista to win this match. Go back to the mountaintop where he was a couple years ago as world heavyweight champion. As Umaga punches the skull of Umaga. My God, somebody stop this man. Thumbs down. You know what's coming next. The Batista bomb to Umaga. Down to the mat. Batista. All he needs to do is cover that man and hope for the best. Umaga kicks out. A kick out by Umaga. And Batista now. Looking for something right there. Make some room. Here comes another spine buster. By Batista. And Batista now. Going for another Batista bomb. To Umaga. Down he goes. Batista now into the cover again. Umaga needs a kick out here. Which he does. Umaga now. Coming back here. Oh, what an uppercut. Umaga. Got him up. Uh-oh. Samoan driver. Puts down Umaga. Or puts down Batista by Umaga. And here's a Samoan spike. Down goes Batista. Umaga is going to WrestleMania. He'll be meeting SmackDown and Raw superstars in the Money in the Bank ladder match. In the backstage area, Dominic Mysterio getting revenge from last week to his father, Rey Mysterio, who cost him the United States Championship over Chad Gable last week in the Neckbreaker Special by Dominic Mysterio. And Dominic, come on, not the steel chair. Oh my God, to the own father. Oh, you didn't know the New Age Outlaws are in the number one contenders tag team match. Road Dog and Billy Gunn. Billy Gunn couldn't make the rumble. X-Pac took his spot. And here he is on Monday Night Raw, the old school episode. And the winners will face the bar at Wrestlemania. The legends are here. And their opponents, Imperium, Marcel Bartel, Fate Man Eitner, no Walter by their side because Drew McIntyre, Powerbomb Walter, off the balcony in the backstage area. But I can't confirm this. It'll be Drew McIntyre versus Walter at Wrestlemania. And Imperium is here to make a statement to everybody on Monday Night Raw. They are old school wrestlers here on the old school episode of Monday Night Raw. The old school team of DX New Age Outlaws taking on the old school tag team of Imperium. But the Road Dog trying to scratch the ref's back for him and try to make him win this match for them. But Fabian Niner. Not making plans to lose to the Road Dog, Jesse James, and Billy Gunn. Billy Gunn can go back to AEW, all he cares. As the Road Dog, Jesse James, coming back here with these punches. The fans on their feet. The legends of the tag team of DX. Oh, but what the hell? Fabian Eitner. Oh, but oh no. Trips on him. And now Fabian Eitner from their Billy Gunn, part of the Gun Club in AEW. And of course, the claim, not sure what's going on there. Recording this way before the Bill Gun turned on the claim or not. Well, again, well, we're not getting into that because it'll be WrestleMania by the time he find turns on them. But I turn to focus back to the tag team match. Got Fabian Einer taking down the Road Dog. And I'm putting them in the, their corner of Imperium. Oh, jeez. 
Road Dog stopped before it meant Martel. And look at this. Road Dog coming back here. These punches, combos, the fans on their feet. For the Road Dog, Jesse James. Oh, look at this. A little shimmy, shimmy. Takes down Fabian Niner into the cover. And a quick kick out by Fabian. Part of the Imperium tag team. For the Road Dog. Missed that one. What in the hell is this? What in the hell is this? Big power bomb. Boom! Down goes the Road Dog. Into the cover. And a kick out. A kick out. Fabian Niner is pissed about that. I'm not sure where the hell Billy Gunn went. Big kick. Road Dog is in trouble. But Fabian Eitner, what the hell is going on with his blood type? He's not human doing moves like that. The power by Fabian Eitner is unreal. Now in the corner, tags in. Oh no, oh no, Imperium Bomb incoming. Down goes our road dog. Takes down Billy Gunn. Not like that, that was too easy for the old school wrestlers of Imperium. They'll be meeting in the bar at Wrestle Minute for the Raw Tag Team titles. I guess in Billy Gunn's contract to return to Raw, was not to actually be in the match. Cause he didn't get it tagged in. But instead, Imperium will be meeting the bar for the Raw Tag Team titles. And also, Walter will be taking on Drew McIntyre at WrestleMania. And now it's time for the in-ring return of Stone Cold Steve Austin. And here we go. The main event of Monday Night Raw, the old school episode, features Stone Cold Steve Austin, the Raw GM, going one on one with MVP, the man it cost him the Raw GM job. An MVP in the ring with Stone Cold Steve Austin posing to the fans. MVP does not care about Stone Cold Steve Austin. These two hate each other. The Hurt Business was not drafted by Stone Cold Steve Austin. That's why Lashley hates his guts. I attacked him the first episode. That's why Austin cost him the WWE title at the Chamber. And last week in the Gauntlet match, or two weeks ago in the Gauntlet match. Here's a tweet by Johnny Gargano. Roman two weeks ago was a small table I can do inside that ring at WrestleMania. This underdog is going to take out the Tribal Chief. Everyone know why they call me Johnny Wrestling. A big match at WrestleMania for Johnny Gargano taking on the WWE Champion Roman Reigns as Gargano won that gauntlet match two weeks ago on Monday Night Raw. Now right here, Austin trying to go after MVP after MVP attacked him during his entrance. Trying to get everybody what they want, a stone cold entrance. But interrupted by MVP. MVP struck Stone Cold Steve Austin with a steel chair. After that, Lashley with one spear. One, two, three. Stone Cold Steve Austin out of a job as Raw GM. And Bobby Lashley was in. Oh, wow, look at Austin stomping on Mud Hole and MVP. And Austin again still delivering the Mud Holes. Oh, geez, what a form by MVP. MVP trying to take out Stone Cold Steve Austin, but Austin told Lashley if you enter this ring or distract anybody in this matchup, you will not face me anytime soon and you will be fired. Big words by Stone Cold Steve Austin to Bobby Lashley. Big match in their old school episode of Monday Night Raw. The Raw GM Stone Cold Steve Austin in action against MVP.
as Austin now trying to take down MVP once and for all. This is a re revenge match for Stone Cold Steve Austin. I mean, a punch. Now, a, a punch to the back again. MVP won't go down, especially for Austin. And Stone Cold Steve Austin, a mud hole, and a goddamn hammer fist like punch to the chest takes down MVP. I'm like a Stone Cold Steve Austin now. Punching the eyes. And now Austin now. To everybody. Oh no. Hit Taunt too long. MVP going to take advantage here. Oh no, he's not. No, he's not. Oh, MVP. Oh, jeez. Perfect flex. Takes down Austin. Another look at MVP. Swing a neck breaker. And you know the history of neck problems with Stone Cold. He's grabbing that neck. He's grabbing that neck. Look at MVP now. Got Austin up on his shoulders. Back down to the outside of the ring. Austin is not moving an inch. But he's trying to get back up. Puts him back down to MVP with some punches to the skull. Oh, what a kick by Austin. What a kick by Stone Cold Steve Austin. Bring MVP back inside the ring. MVP trying to get back up to his feet as Stone Cold is right there to meet him. The Stone Cold Stunner that reversed by MVP. But MVP, Stone Cold Stunner by Austin. Look the bird again. Another Stone Cold Stunner to MVP. But there's our rope break. There's our rope break. Austin now knows what just happened. Oh, what a clothesline. And again. Oh, missed the Stone Cold Stunner. Reversed by MVP. Now MVP puts over Stone Cold Steve Austin into the cover and a kick out. Austin trying to get back up to his feet as MVP missed that big move right there. Takes down Austin. Austin now puts down by MVP and a big kick. Stone Cold Steve Austin stomping a mud hole with MVP. And the punches start to begin again. Going for another Stone Cold Stunner. And Austin got on back up. Going for another Stone Cold Stunner. Hopefully away from the ropes. Referee count the th no the rope break rope break ref he, the referee does not care he does not care he hates MVP as well there was our rope break ref and he did not care about anything but that's his boss right there Stone Cold Steve Austin is his boss there's a rope break the referee did not see a damn thing but Bobby Lashley Right behind Stone Cold Steve Austin with a steel chair. That's part of this whole damn thing. And now, the spear by Bobby Lashley puts down Stone Cold Steve Austin. Bring the steel chair back to hit the referee. As we end the old school episode of Monday Night Raw. Make sure to like and subscribe. Next episode is the old school episode of SmackDown. Don't want to miss it. Make sure I like and subscribe. Peace.